Hello everyone, my name is Webweaver, and welcome back to Shadow of Wardor. So on the last episode... Oh hey, how did we get here? I just saved and quit when we landed on that ground right there. Here we're purifying a thing. Anyways, we're playing Shadow of Wardor, if I didn't already say that. And uh, on this episode, I don't know what we're gonna do. I guess we're gonna scan this. And uh, we're gonna find some freaking Gondorian artifacts and mark them on our map. Uh, that's really far away. Where are we going, dude? There's something. Just kind of wondering where it all is. Because it's not gonna be, like, down here, is it? It can't be. Ah, here we go. That's that fortress we were over in the last episode, I do believe. Alright, so we got everything here. So I want to go do the main quest? Seems like something that we're going to want to do, you know what I mean? Alright, so we're going to get details on this time. We got a guy right here. We got an unknown captain. Let's... Flack the Tracker. Heavily damaged by stealth. He's a sickly boy, so poison works well against him. He's afraid of being exied. And he's damaged by ranged exies and fire. It's nice to know. We got options against him. And you know, I'm not entirely a fan. <laughs> I forgot we had the hammer equipped. It's probably pretty loud. Uh, there's another worm up here. We're just getting so many worms, dude. Excuse me. I would like to read your mind. You are mine, my boy. Uh, Nurik the Sickly, Crook the Kinslayer. We can't get any deets on the guys up here. So I suppose we'll just get uh, this guy right here. Rash the Mad-Eye. Oh, jeez, buddy, you okay? Uh, you're... You're kind of missing, <laughs> kind of missing an eye right there. Probably got terrible depth perception. Uh, he's flammable. He's vulnerable to stealth. Sickly beast fodder. He's soft-headed, and uh, he's damaged by ranged attacks. He's susceptible to frost. So that works with the new sword that we just got for killing that uh, asshole who we hate. But, uh, honestly, I think that we're gonna ignore the Gondorian artifact. Let's just jump on down here, get those arrows. You know, we are hammers, I guess I should say. And, uh, let's just climb up this wall right here. It's a nice wall. It's clearly textured for the sake of us knowing that it's a place that we should climb up. It's nice. But, uh, let's see here. We're actually pretty far away from our objective. What is that skull over there? I don't... I'm not entirely sure what that skull is. Yeah, no you don't. You think you do, but you don't. That's not at all what I wanted to do, but that double jump is so good. So what's this? Unknown captain, investigate Clue? We are close to a slave team. I wonder if that would be any comfort to them, if they knew it. Follow the tracks to find Horza Skin Flare. What's this? Yeah, there's just like some tracks that we can follow. I'm uh, unsure. Don't worry about it. I don't know how, I don't know why there's like death raining from the sky, but Takra Skull Crusher. He's vulnerable to stealth. That's all that we need to know. What are these freaking explosions for, man? Hello. It's a worm. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Just tell us what we want to know and you can live. Hey. Or is it the skin flare? That's the quest that we're doing right now. Posh, the champion of Gorgoth. He's vulnerable to stealth. That's all we need to know. I mean, it's good to unlock their weaknesses, but unless we have a specific plan to actually, like, you know, murder them, I think we're good. Oh, oh, he's here! Time to compose a symphony of 
broken bones Wait, hold up. And rent flesh. I don't. I'm. Uh, hold up. I thought we were gonna gain intel by, you know, fall. Oh, oh boy. I. You know, I'm okay. I'm good. I'm good. And by that, I mean, yo. Give me the intel about Orza, if you don't mind. I'd like to know. He's clumsy. He's a soft target. He's beast fodder. Damaged by stealth. Perfect. That's all we needed to know. Goodbye, my friend. Alright. Uh-oh. Hey, look, 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 it doesn't matter, it's just, shh, shh. okay, okay, uh, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, we'll just run away from him, <laughs> we'll just run away from him and hide, it's all good, nobody will see us ever again, look, can I just climb up here, thank you, I'd appreciate it, thank you very much, is there anybody up here with us, oh, there's somebody over there, who is he, uh, can I walk onto him, Claw. Croc the poker. He's beast proof. Alright. Don't worry, I wasn't gonna use any beasts on you, my friend. I'm not a big fan of using beasts myself. So, let's just go ahead and jump on over here. Assassinate that tower boy. Alright, so they're losing interest in me. So we should be able to just murder them. Although, how are we gonna get over... We can shoot those buckets. What do those buckets do? I can't tell, because I can't actually aim. Alright, can I uh, jump up here, or... I can't tell which one it's gonna we're going to drop on. There's only one way to find out. I should nail your feet down! hi -ho. You can't kill us all! Uh, you know. Oh, he's a vault breaker. Oh, jeez. Bethesda's worst nightmare. <laughs> you don't. It's fine. You don't have ears. We can also unlock a skill. So let's go. Just let's just go ahead and do that. Um. Perfect counter. I already have it. Critical strike. Melee attacks have a chance of causing critical damage. Uh, mighty shot. When your might is full, press R1 to fire an explosive shot. Never really been a fan of that. Uh, Elven Light. Oh, yeah, I remember Elven Light. Ice Storm. Consume. See, I want to get the ability to get an army of orcs. So we really just want to do the main quest. So we're going to use... Yeah, Silent Runner. That's nice. Sprinting no longer causes sound. Sounds good. Yeah, so after we kill this guy, I want to do the main... Oh, they see us. Oh, let's see what this does. I don't know what that does. I, I'm not entirely sure what that does. Uh, I don't really think that buckets could really cause a lot of damage, so... You know, I color me unconvinced. I'm a skeptic of the buckets, but it's fine. You know, it's, it's all good. We'll just wait for them to lose interest, and then we'll stealth attack that boy. Uh, can I? Oh, that's a zip line. That's not something that we can jump on top of. So, fair enough. You know, fair enough. I love the double jump. The double jump is like the best thing they added to this game. It just improves your mobility so much. Now the question is, can we double jump? Oh, we don't even have to double jump. That's how great it is. We can just jump once, but if we couldn't make it, then the double jump is always there for us. So let's just assassinate this guy. He's so close to death. What was that? All right, look, my man. Uh, what? Did he just? Okay, look, 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 look. Hammer. Oh my God, this is ridiculous. All right, look. 
get hammered. And I'm not giving you a shot. <laughs> Skull. Ah! Oh yeah, we had a challenge for that. So we unlocked the uh, bonus ability for our hammer, right? So we'll just jank this guy for fun. Why not? Alright, so let's check out our uh, new hammer. That is not the inventory button. That's the map button. Inventory. We can upgrade it with $15 reduce. So we'll definitely do that. Achievement unlocked. Fit for war. I should have run when the battle turned. Snafu the chop. 16% chance to replenish one elf shot per ranged kill. Sounds interesting. Because... With that, we would be able to... How to... Oh, recruit an orc from the Dark Tribe. We can't recruit orcs yet. So I can't do that challenge. But hopefully by doing this main quest over here, we will be able to recruit orcs. But back to that train of thought. 16% um, chance seems really bad. But hear me out here, alright? It's an AoE attack. So there's a chance that we could kill multiple orcs. Maybe even hordes of orcs with one hammer. And if we can do that, then that means that it's worth it. So we're just going to drop down here. Nobody's going to see us. It's fine. No man's land start. If the orc army is launching their attacks from Sirith Ungol, join Baranor and take the fight to Mordor. Sounds good to me, man. Sounds like the rebels from the first game. Baranor. How are you here? You can't have run out of orcs in the city. There are a few left, but we're hunting one in particular. The last bodyguard of the What do you mean? The city's infested the with orcs. War chiefs are very powerful orcs who are often guarded by captains. Understanding who guards a war chief and hunting them down makes first defeating the war chiefs much easier. The army menu shows you which captains guard a war chief. Yo, let's go, dude. The war chiefs in this region are the leaders of the orc army. By selecting a war chief, you can see his bodyguards. Bulg the Scorcher, huh? That's a guy that I really didn't want to fight. But I suppose we have to. Hunt down and defeat a war chief's bodyguards before confronting the war chief himself to make defeating him easier. Help Baranor hunt and kill this bodyguard. Well, if we got help. I think we're off the same one. Mortally vulnerable to stealth. What the hell was I talking about that I didn't want to fight him? Am I insane? And the way to a war chief is through his bodyguards. You sound like you've had some experience. Oh, you have You're no idea. Enough. I'll follow your lead. I'll follow your lead and watch your back. Excuse me? When you're undetected, you can command your summoned bodyguard to kill a nearby target. Aim at an enemy and press... Alright, cool. Baranor's got some skills. Man, like, I'm, I'm good, yo. Oh. Alright. We have to do challenges for Baranor. That's the... Alright. Ah, don't worry about it. 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 Don't. Worry about it. Don't. That's pretty loud. You didn't die. Okay, it's fine. Is this gonna work? He's looking right at him. Oh, you go, Baronor. Well, that works. So you just gotta run at him. So, uh, okay, I'll come back. Uh, okay. Where am I really going here? Go kill him, Baron, or you can leave the mission area. It's fine. But I can't. I mean, if you get spotted over there, that's kind of your own. Oh my god. Is this gonna work? Is this gonna count as a stealth Baranor kill? Oh my god. Okay, we'll back him. We'll back Baranor up. The freaking hammer. Alright. What do you mean I'm leaving the mission area? I'm right here, dude. Find the bodyguard's trail. Investigate a clue. Bring the trail into focus. 
Man, these are human feet, but all right, not care, not Caragor feet. Definitely human feet. Absolutely. Oh yeah, <laughs> double assassination, boys. All right, just poison that just in case. I now understand that we were supposed to come over here the entire time. This is just beautiful. <laughs> We're too good. We're too good, dude. Oh my god, it's so freaking obvious what they wanted us to do with the stealth kills. <laughs> what do you mean, dude? Baronor, what did you just do? Man, hush, Nazgul. Shink. Man, Baranor is a freaking god, man. That's amazing. Just go get him, Baranor. You're our, you're our secret weapon. You don't see anything. That's right. Go, go get him, Paranor. I'll get this guy up here. You watch the land, I'll watch the skies. <laughs> oh, there he is. Dude, mortally vulnerable to stealth. Can we just have Baranor kill him? That'd be hilarious. I just hear an orc dying in the background, and that makes me happy. Oh, okay, hold on. Okay, hold up. That's not what I wanted to do. What? What? What is going on? What? Excuse me? Oh my god, we have... <laughs> Man, who needs freaking Brim and Talion when you've got this absolute mad lad? How's he gonna kill this guy? I wanna see. I'm pretty curious. Can we see the dagger flying up through the- <gasps> Oh my god, Baranoi, you're a monster. Oh my god. Can we stealth kill someone on a freaking Karagor? We can, technically. Uh, no, you don't see anything. Don't worry about it. Yeet! Oh no! It just knocks him off the Karagor! It still worked! Hey, look. Karagor? Be mine. Oh, cutscene. Cool. I didn't want that armor or anything. I almost feel sorry for the war chief we're hunting. He'll be lonely without his bodyguards. I feel bad for the entire orc army. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. That was horrifying. Baranor is a god. Man, how could we not get Baranor's stealth kills? The war chiefs of Seer and Gaul are leading the orc forces against Minas Ethel without its leaders. Something, something, something. Soldiers from Minas Ethel have been sent to help you defeat the War Chiefs. I really don't think the War Chief Baranor seeks is just one of many. And yeah, one of many. Their attacks on Minas Ethel. Then our path is clear. Hey guys. We have to kill them all. They will need help from the Gondorians to do it. Just glad they're invincible. No worries about it, man. Don't worry about it. You've got a squad now. Don't worry about it. Alright, look. So, unlock skill, huh? We've gotten call followers. Let's go all the way down there. I don't really... Cluster of spiders play all the story... Wait, wait. 
play unlocked by playing all the story quests? Wait, what do you mean all the story quests? We don't get the idea. We don't get an orc bodyguard until we beat the campaign. Are you insane? What? That's lame as hell, man. Dragon song? Man, I don't even freaking know. Mighty shot, pretty lame. Bird of prey. Uh, brutal cold. Freeze pin causes nearby enemies to flee in terror. And then bursting arrow. Shoot fire pits to detonate them without shadow striking them. Now you're speaking my goddamn language, my man. That's wonderful. Well, that was an incredibly easy and quick mission, so I feel like we should just do something else, man. We should probably do the next one. Uh, better cloak. Yeah, I'll take it. Still wearing our Gondorian armor from our boy Scoth. I, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm upset. You, you guys can just go away. I don't care. Like, I don't need the freaking soldiers, all right? I'm not that lame that I need my own. I don't, dude. I only care about having orc followers. I don't freaking care. I'm in. I'm a Xenos player. All right. I have an orc army. Why would I ever want like freaking imperial scum or whatever? You know? Man blood. The swarm oh my can never God. rest. It is a buzzing male. Can you just? I just. You will be infested. I, I'm just, I'm, I just, I'm, oh my god, what, wh why are you still here? He's epic, tr he's epic, he's an assassin, except he announces himself, he, I don't, oh my god, I can't, man, I don't want to be, dude, I don't want, I don't want to be here, I don't want to, I don't want to be here, dude. Can, I just I don't care I just want to get to the story quest don't mind me it's all right all right we're good okay we're good we're good stealth has been restored although hold up ah, I didn't expect that to alert the entire camp but you know good. Hey, you got weaknesses? Play quests to interact with this character. Alright. Glad to... Glad to know that that happened. Ugber Bone Licker. Don't care. If we run into you, we'll identify you. Alright, look. It's fine. Uh, please leave. Please leave. Please leave me alone! Why can't I sprint? Why can't I sprint? Thank you very much. Mm, yeah, don't worry about it. You got uh, intel for me, my my boy, my dude, uh, my my bro, among the flesh glutton. All right, I don't really care. I I don't really care. Can we just do the story mission, please? I want to unlock more. This game has freaking. Look, I don't care about the alarm. You know, it's so weird. Like, it's such a freaking. It's such a shift, you know what I mean? Like, when I was playing Shadow of Mordor, couldn't care less about the story. But at the same time, I didn't know that you could get those sick... Are we even going the right way? I got no idea. Uh, I didn't know that we could get those, like, sick, you know, orc followers and whatnot. We could make our own orc army. Excuse me? Controller? Hello? I didn't know that we could... Oh, no. Is this where I think it is? Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. What was that? We got a boy. I think my controller's starting to freaking glitch out or something, you know? It's like... We got all these boys who are dead right here. They have yet to either come back alive or be replaced. So we've only got two unknown captains left. Carcorn Brawlmaster. I, I don't really care. We'll look at him. Here's the thing. They've added a very nice feature, excuse me, where when you come into contact with some, with one of them, you can actually just click in the right stick. Excuse you, Namira. You can just click in the right stick and bada bing bada boom. You've got it. Rain of arrows. I'm down. 
Return to Shelob to learn. Oh my god. Please, no. I don't want to see the spider. Italian and Brimmer just gonna fight spider. again. Um, guys, 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 guys. And tell me what you wish to see. Lena's evil still standing. All is so selfless. Nothing more. We saw some troubling things last time. Can you get out of my... Have, have you heard of personal space? Fate with the Nazgul. Be careful what you ask for, Ranger. With prophecy. Look, we're just... Can, can you not touch my face, please? We take the city Who are you? Submit to your destiny. And I don't know about you, but... I know what you fear, Tony. Shelob's vision is not cast in stone. I mean, it's not. We've changed the future like three times now. Yo, I'm just gonna take a sip real quick. The Witch King. The Witch the King? The power of domination. The ring can enslave the minds. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be a real normie here. Is Sauron the Witch King? What can be done? Sacrifices must be made, and many will be lost. Man, Brim just speaking but the freaking grim truth right here. We must hold to our purpose. No Revenge. Starting an orc army, rocking out. Look, I just want to be able to get an orc army, all right? Can be saved. If the war chief from my vision is the same one Baron and his men are hunting, they will need help. One war chief makes little difference. Right Why can't now, I this sprint? one war chief there we is go. the most immediate threat to Minas Ethel. I will not stand by while Baron and his men risk their quick. lives to take him down. I mean, I don't really know why Brim and Talion are being so freaking you know, insulting to each other. It doesn't make any sense. You were gonna kill all the war chiefs anyways. So why the why the hell does it matter? Sure, we'll summon our boys. We can't summon our boys. We are ready. What? I didn't have any boys to summon. No, it no. doesn't matter. I'm here to help. This war chief you're after. He's not one to be taken lightly. We've brought down war chiefs before, Ranger. But I won't turn down an extra sword. And we shall take him down together. I'll take out his archers first. Your men move in after I've cleared the path. Cool. Bonus objective kill four archers without. Okay, kill ten archers without raising the alarm. It's fine by me. Too much grog, not enough combat. Excuse me, is that a timer that we have down in the bottom corner? Is that how long we have to complete this quest? Because if so, that's kind of dickish. We usually work alone. I hope the aim of these Gondorian archers is true. Otherwise, we'll be dodging friendly arrows. They're experienced soldiers. They'll do their part. I'm doing my part. Subscribe to PewDiePie. <laughs> Orcs around here? Or is it just that guy? Why is there a freaking archer just hanging out in the grass? Alright, so one thing we're gonna do real quick, because the hammer is not quiet at all, we're just gonna change to a bow of some sort. Yeah. I mean, we could unlock a freaking rune for the bow. What is this? View legendary sets? Oh, this is like the tribe stuff. I remember that. Alright. You know, if we get the ability to recruit soon, we might as well recruit the, uh, freaking... Excuse me? Uh, we should recruit... Would be worth three Gondorian archers. Really? Only three? hey -oh. I mean, honestly, I don't know why Brim's being an asshole. I just, I really don't get it, dude. Stab a pigskin. Oh, you 
Because it's like... I mean, why don't we go get some freaking elven archers? You know, Brim? Like, why don't we just go? I'm pretty sure we get to ride dragons later in the game. That's something you see in the marketing, marketing material a lot. So why don't we just, like, go grab a freaking... What? Why don't we go just grab a freaking dragon, Brim? And then go fly to a freaking elven country. And then it's like, oh, hey. I'm the freaking guy who created the rings. I'm like a god-tier elven smith. Come fight for me, boys. And then, you know, you just, like, imagine the elves don't take you seriously. Even though you're a freaking ghost that literally created the rings. Don't, don't even at me. You don't even see me. What? I didn't mean to do that, but, you know, it works. They tried to kill each other. I. Man. Man filth bringing orcs together. What a wonderful life. Alright, we've done it. We did it before the timer ran out, so that's nice. Time to signal better those men. All right, boys, let's go. Let's go. Ah, what does he even do? Nothing is sweeter. Together, we will crush their defenses and grind them. You're a war chief. You're lame. Together, as captains and war chief united, we will have victory. Together, we take the city at dawn. Oh man, nobody That's sees the them. Please. Nobody oh, sees oh. them. I mean, honestly, why doesn't freaking strike? Yeah, I agree. All right, what do you do? Vulnerable to stealth. All right. You've got no. How did you see us? Whatever. We'll just murder him. <laughs> nice marble fade, the loser. Alright. Okay, hold up. Oh, that's my mistake. Ow. Okay, hold up. Whoa! Yeah, there's a lot of freaking uh ah! I thought you were on fire so you were gonna die but you didn't die dun 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 dun, dun. got him who are you wait a minute why am I burning to death I'm burning to death all right this has gone really Horribly wrong. Orc, poisonous berserker, has been slain. Wonderful. Oh, hey. We're gonna die, by the way. Like, I don't know if you noticed, but we are absolutely gonna die. Or Baranor is a god. Oh my G Jesus Christ, Baranor is just a monstrosity. A good hunt. Less so for the war chief. And these archers. Should go hunting again. It would be my pleasure. Jesus Christ, Baranor is a monster. So, Talia, did we make a difference? I mean, we killed a war chief. Oh my God! You're just sitting we like that. See your ends. We must return to Shirob. The only reason to go back is for my ring. Enough. Objectively true. This is about more than your ring. Or you. Her sight may be what saves us all. Italian, did you forget that she's an a demon? <laughs> Italian, what are you doing, man? He's always beside you. He's your goddamn stand. I just I can't take this seriously because I don't th Oh my god. I, I just I can't take it seriously because it's like 
Italian is just being irrational here. It's like, why Mary would... Italian. You trust her too easily. Yeah. I can't ignore what she has shown me. Like, I don't, I don't, I just don't get it, man. I just don't get why Italian's being like, oh, yeah, Shelob's great. It's like, here's the thing. I was actually wrong. Shelob's not a spider. She's just a straight-up demon, right? How do you get up there? Look. How do you get up there? Probably the other side. What are they doing over there? I don't really care. But here's the thing, man. It's like, Shelob's not a spider. She's like a freaking demon that takes the form of a spider. So, I just think that, like, you know, not only does Talion trust Shelob way too freaking easily, but he also is incredibly naive, and Brim has basically just been... I mean... Brim's just been right the entire time, dude. The last dude. king of Gondor, Aena, challenged the Witch King himself in the heart of Angmar. Armored for war, not ceremony, he left his crown behind when he wrote to his fate. We hold it in trust for the day when a king of Gondor will return to wear it. Though we need a future king with enough sense not to confront the Witch King alone. How did his crown get here? This crown is worthy of a king. Ah, but your people have spurned their kings, have they not? I just, I don't, I don't get the sass. I, I just don't get the sass. I, I mean, I love the sass. Like, Brim just sitting on the frickin' pallet of wood is like the one of the greatest things I've ever seen. But at the same time, it's like, what even is this game's story? Yo, we got some uh, last war chief, Mog the Knife. I don't really care. We've uh, we've gotten everybody revealed except for the corpses. Don't worry about it. You didn't see anything. There's a tre it's a treasure orc, but I think what I'd like to do is get close to the story mission so that when we uh, restart, you know what'd be hilarious? If you guys just fought a bunch of beasts right now. Wouldn't that just be freaking hilarious? But yeah, I want to get close to the... I pressed R1 to grab... What is this, Shadow of Mordor? I don't even remember if you had to press R1 to grab arrows in the first place. It might have just been automatic. Whoop! <laughs> I love it. I love the double jump so much. It's literally, like, one of the greatest things of all time. We can sprint for so long. It's so good. All right, so we're here, basically. It's probably going to move us again. And might as well unlock the skill before we end the episode. What do we uh, What do we got here, man? What do we got here? I really hate... Brutal Cold... Okay, here's the thing. Brutal Cold could be good. Reign of Arrows. Reprisal. Unstoppable. Elven Precision. That's Fantasy Star Online gameplay right there. Yeah, I think Brutal Cold's all right. Because a lot of the time when we use pinning, it's on the war... It's on, like, the frickin' special orcs. And, you know, that sort of, like... If their bodyguards or whatever, or their group ran away from them, then that would probably let us knock them down. And then we could probably get a stab on them. So, anyways. I have been Web Weaver. You guys have been awesome. This has been Shadow of Wardor, and on the next episode, we're going to keep doing the story mission. Wow, what an absolute unit. We're going to keep doing the story missions because <laughs> he's looking up to him. He's literally looking up to him. We're going to do the story missions because we found out on this episode that you don't actually get an orc bodyguard until you beat the campaign. So, we need to beat the campaign as soon as possible so that we can get an orc bodyguard and go on adventures with him. And, uh, look, look at this guy. Look at this guy. Look at this dude. I'll see you guys in the next episode of Shadow of War Door or Arc Noir. Mm, bye.